And the lovely Lindsay Bell joining us uh, this morning. Good to see you, Lindsay. How's it going? I have never been better in my entire life. It's great <laughs> to have you joining us today. Thank you. Now, uh, you've picked up a guitar and you started uh, playing a few years ago, and it's really grown into quite something. Yes, I was a little bit of a closet singer, writer, if you would. Um, never, ever expected in a million years that I would ever be doing it in front of people. Um, yeah, I just take it one day at a time. So now we've, I've noticed you uh, as well on on your Facebook page with with a number of videos you put on over the past few years. And man, alive, uh, are you putting out some good stuff? I'm enjoying it. I'm enjoying the writing process probably more than anything. Um, the whole public performances they kind of scare me a little. They always will, but um, I guess it's right now the only way I have to share my songs with people is to. Put them out there and right? you're taking it now to the next level i'm trying a little bit i don't even know what i'm doing am i trying i don't know i'm i'm just going with it right my stars have aligned like when i met um rylan chessel is the one that's doing my um producing my album and it kind of just happened he kind of fell on my lap and it just worked out sometimes when you don't go looking for it is when it kind of all starts to fall into place. Now tell us about the, the album and uh, some of the singles that we can look forward to. Well, there's going to be 12 songs on the album. I had to laugh earlier when we were chatting. I said, are you going to pick your favorite songs? And, and you, you said, <laughs> it, you can't because they're all your favorite. Yeah, right? I feel like I gave birth to, to them all. They're all like special in a, a way. They all were written for maybe a reason. If I'm out and speaking to somebody and... Um, they say something and it like puts a line in my head um sometimes songs take longer to write well let, play us a song we'll pick one which is the first one you want to play for um, us today um i'm gonna play a song um it's called i am me and you are you one two I like 
that I like cleaning and off the hook. Huh? Yeah. <laughs> That's a great hook. Right, right. <laughs> That's awesome. That's well, awesome. It works, right? It, it does. It does. So that particular song, how did you, how did it come about? Was that like a quick right for you? Was that uh, one that it took was a very bit? quick. This one probably took probably ten minutes. Uh, wow. I'm pretty sure I had it written and probably posted on Facebook within 20 minutes. So I don't know, some of them just come and I don't really know where this one came from. Um, actually, you know what, I'm lying. I do know where this one came from. I follow a girl on Instagram and uh, she had made a post about um, her and her husband. She's a free spirit. She's completely um, off the wall and out in left field, probably a lot like myself. And her husband is like uh, in the military and they're completely opposites, but they work. And she had said, oh, he lets me be exactly who I am and whatever. So I think that's where the whole polar opposite and like the the whole just being completely different, but it worked. Mm -hmm. It works. You know, sometimes it just works. <laughs> <laughs> so yeah, that's, what, that is where that came from. That was a terrific song. You have another one that you want to showcase? Uh, yeah, for sure. The next song that I will do is... Uh, it's a more serious topic. The partner had had an affair, is how it went. And uh, basically I just said like, how? How do you do it after that? Like, what do you do? And she just said I had to find a new way to love him. So that held space in my mind for a super long time. And then I don't know if I was what, driving to get a coffee in the morning. And it all of a sudden just went in my mind. And I thought, oh gosh, I gotta get home to my book fast. So then yeah, I wrote it. Um, it basically fell onto the paper in less than 15 minutes, and it's really one of my favorite songs to perform. All right. Um, so, yeah. And a, and, a, uh, and a terrific message, too, a powerful message. Please. Yeah, and this one's called uh, Find a New Way to Love Me.
first time I ever performed that song live. It was actually very, um, I didn't do an introduction of the song. I just started playing it. And let me tell you, the, the energy in the room was huge. Um, and I just remember looking up and partway singing it and looking up and you know, you see all of a sudden a husband grab his wife's leg and her eyes are filled with tears or you see like three rows back and there's a wife reaches over and grabs her husband's neck and like they, so I feel like without even knowing you, you're connecting with people and they're connecting with the song and they're feeling it for whatever reason. But in that moment, I felt like possibly so we had a moment without having a moment. Mm -hmm. And then I had to just look down and focus because I get emotional when I sing my song. So I was like, oh, I just got to get through it. Don't make any <laughs> eye contact with that audience ever again, no. Lindsay. So, <laughs> so yeah. Yeah. Right on. No, well, that's good. when you know you have something special. So yeah, thank you so much Alrighty. for having me, and I look forward to coming back.